Well, welcome back to Bay Area Focus. Uh, let's jump right into this next segment. This is going to be fun. My guest is Jeff Saihaki. He is a winemaker at Bonterra Organic Vineyards. Thank you for coming to Bay Area Focus. Oh, happy to be here. This is great. And bringing lots of beautiful wines. So yeah, let's I like talk to share the wines. This, wine. yeah, yeah. this is great. So, um, first a little about Bonterra. Um, uh, we're an organic vineyard up in Mendocino County, about 100 miles north of San Francisco here. Um, we've been farming organically for over 30 years now. And what does that mean? Well, Good question. Organic farming basically is viticulture or grape growing without using any synthetic pesticides, mm -hmm. herbicides, or fertilizers. Okay. So we find natural ways to uh, make sure the, the vines can create fruit every year and to the quality we need to produce these, these wines. So it's uh, that we can enjoy them here. Whenever we think of organic food, we always know that it's a, it tends to be a little bit more mm -hmm. expensive. Does that mean that the wine is a little um, more expensive? You know, it's, fortunately for Bonterra brand, um, we're pretty competitive when it comes to the pricing. We're on par with the many different conventional wines out there. So yeah. you'll you'll find our wines, uh, we have good distribution, you'll find them all over the country and certainly here in San Francisco. Well, let's talk about these beautiful wines. Cool. So we brought some wines that are kind of indicative of spring. Mm -hmm. So we're starting with um, the first two wines here, our South Blanc right here. South Blanc is a uh, Really nice, fresh, uh, vibrant it wine. It just looks it. It looks it. It's got a kind yeah. of greenish hue to it. Yeah. Very spring-like, and now we're in the middle of spring, moving on to summer. It's a great wine. It's very refreshing. Um, and for food and wine pairing, you think about as we start eating more fresh foods, mm -hmm. um, our wine should be lighter and more fresh, too. So you kind of have that, think about that as you pair. Okay, shall we taste? Let's take a little taste, sure. All right, let's do this. So this is, our, again, our Bonterra Sauvignon Blanc. Oh, you did so well. Oh, I, I just, just can't. A lot, lot of yeah, miles of practicing control. there. Yes, that's true. <laughs> okay. But as you can smell, a lot of grapefruit, really crisp, refreshing. Yeah, it's fresh and it tastes absolutely wonderful. As you can imagine, a wine to enjoy outside on the patio on a summer day. Yeah. Really and what refreshing. would you pair something like this with? Um, lately, we, we had some like springtime pizzas where we were doing uh, light cheese, some um, asparagus, some uh, fresh peas. Uh, all with a, you know, a little olive oil drizzle on top. Works really well. Oh my gosh, you're making me so hungry. Okay, this next one is beautiful <laughs> sure. because this so looks like a nice crisp pink. Yeah, it is. This is our Bonterra Rosé. And here we go for, for you. Thank um, you. So rosés are super popular right now. And this is a dry style rosé. Um, we source our grapes again up in Mendocino County as well. Um, the base grape for this is uh, Grenache, which is a grape... Uh, originally from the Southern Rhone region in France, but it does really well up in Mendocino. And it makes a really dry, beautiful, um, soft, and um, you can see the color uh, there is really, it's really appropriate. It's a great wine for, again, not a casual wine, uh, again, patio wine, mm. um, a little more versatile when it comes to food and wine pairing because it, it is made from red grapes to mm. make, you know, make a white, uh, you know, a pink wine from red grapes. Uh, so it has some little structure to it. So you can even m uh, enjoy it with other meats and, and charcuterie, uh, you know, uh, grilled chicken, something like that. It's just a real, again, really refreshing yes, wine. And it tastes great. Okay, we got to move on to the next mm. one before we run out of time. No, but I'll just take another sip. Yeah, please do. <laughs> cool. So this one. And the third wine on our flight here is our new Equinox Red Blend okay. from Bonterra. Uh, so this is, red blends are quite popular right now. And um, so that we, we uh, this is our new release. This came out about a month ago. Mm -hmm. So, um, and it's, it's a wine that really showcases bright red fruit, really soft tannins. Uh, and it's based with uh, Merlot and Petite Syrah. So it's a lot of jammy okay. notes, some good structure, uh, a great wine for uh, food and wine pairing for a hardier fare. Um, and you know, in, in, in San Francisco, you can always find a cool evening to enjoy a nice big glass of red wine. So, right, so, yeah, so and it is, no... it, it's delicious. Why is Bonterra so committed to organic? Um, it's it's, it's kind of just, in our DNA, you know, it's, it's part of what the, fam the Fetzer family started years ago. The Fetzer Winery is our parent company, and they started um, uh, winemaking 50 years ago. They're sending their anniversary, and they were sustainable right from the start. And this was a natural extension of farming these vineyards that are in our backyards and um, just doing it in a way that's sustainable. And, you know, it, it enhances the, the soil each year rather than mm -hmm. detracting from it. Well, all are so delicious. So oh, thank you so much for bringing that. I think this one is my favorite, Salud. even though they're the all winner. really good. So well, cheers. cheers. Salud. Salud. Thank you for bringing the wine. And for more information, you can go to the website, bonterra.com. And that is going to do it for our show this week. But we will be back with more Bay Area Focus next week. Be sure to check us out on Facebook and, of course, our website, kpixtv.com slash Bay Area Focus. Thanks for watching, everybody. Have a great day. Bye.